Elena, is something wrong? Are you feeling sick again? No, I was just watching the sea. But then I saw that thing. Valmar's moon, huh? It's like it's always staring at us. I hate it. That moon, it haunts me. Seeing it pains my heart. Say, Helena, want me to make it vanish? Huh? Ah! <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Thanks. Such a small gesture made me feel so much better. Oh. I wish that moon would disappear forever. Me too. It always disappears, but comes right back. You know what? The world is so beautiful. Wide and peaceful after all. I used to think everyone was terrified of Valmar and isolated by the Granicliffs and suffering so terribly. I really didn't know anything about the world. Just realizing that you were naive is half the battle, Elena. I guess I can't call you naive. Right now, I want to forget everything. My mission to save the world, Valmar. Myself as a sister of Granus. Tomorrow, well, right now, I want to forget a little. Elena, you really do work incredibly hard. Huh? You're misunderstood, even though you work so hard. <sighs> I've never looked at the world the way you do. I've only wanted to forget, to erase my horrible past. You mean... Melfis? I thought I would have been happier to forget it all, but it didn't turn out like that. I couldn't escape from my painful past. I... I'm sorry. I didn't see you for who you are, Ryudo. I never noticed your pain. I'm sorry. I was terribly naive after all. But seeing you work so hard has changed me. Huh? Yeah, think about it. I thought it was so obvious. If it weren't for this journey with you, I may have never realized it. It was you. Thanks, Elena. Ryudo, it is I who should thank you. With you, I can be so honest. I can be so strong of heart. I'm glad I met you. Elena. I love this wonderful world. I love everyone who lives in it and works hard to make it better. <sighs> Thank you for cheering me up, Ryudo. Now I can work even harder. Ah, uh, <laughs> now that's the Elena I know. Tomorrow, we cross the Granite Cliffs.
practice if you want to beat me. if you want to beat me.
take that! Ten say can slash!
Did you say Melfi? Is he back?
I wonder what happened to Ryudo here. Is this really where he grew up? Miss, do you really want to know what happened to Ryudo? Who are you? It does not matter. Do not look outside. Look and I will leave. One more thing. Do not repeat this to anyone. Understand? Uh, all right. Just tell me, what happened? Known as the Village of Swordsmen, this is where men came to polish their skills and pursue the way of the sword. Melfis and Ryudo were raised by the village chief after they lost their parents when they were young. The two began combat training and soon showed incredible progress. Melfis in particular became the greatest swordsman the village had ever seen. spent all day, every day, practicing with his best friend, Gata. Melfus was admired for being the strongest swordsman in the village. Eventually, Melfus became engaged to the village chief's daughter, Rina. The good-natured Rina was already like a sister to Ryudo. Like this sword without a cloud, like this blade pure and true, we, we shall become, become swordsmen, swordsmen, strong of heart. 